So this place where we get to work and some of us even actually live here is called the Jones Center at Itchaway. And the way I kind of separate those is to me the Jones Center is what we do and Itchaway is where we do it. It's a special, rare piece of property. It's a piece of longleaf pine ecosystem that you're not going to find really anywhere else. The longleaf pine ecosystem is among the most diverse in the entire world. And uh, a lot of species diversity in terms of the number of plants and mammals and reptiles and amphibians. We know a lot less about the insects that are found in the longleaf pine ecosystem. We've identified maybe 300 species here. There's surely way more than that. In fact, our kind of informal slogan here is there's so many bugs and there's so little time. Part of our work is to determine what are the components of the longleaf pine ecosystem, especially the insects. Anything we do in the entomology lab is gonna involve capturing insects and monitoring insect populations in some way. And so an average day for the people in our lab is to head out into the field, check various insect traps that we've got in various plots, many of them corresponding exactly to some graduate student project, bringing them back into the lab, separating out all these sometimes hundreds, even thousands of insects we catch in a trap by group into species that we might be interested in counting in particular, then pinning them on little tiny pins, putting them in drawers, and eventually identifying them down to species wherever we can. So it's a lot of field work followed by a lot of lab work to really narrow it down to exactly what insects we've found. This is a Lindgren funnel trap. And to beetles, it kind of looks like the silhouette of a tree. So they fly into it and then fall down into this cup here. And uh, yeah, look, you can see all sorts of things. Basically, we just pour it into this jar. And we'll bring this back to the lab and process it, sort through it, and identify what we have. We're discovering species that we haven't found here in Itchaway. Without a doubt, they're species unknown to science on this property. We may have them already in jars inside our lab and we just haven't gotten to them yet, but without, without a doubt, there are insects unknown to science on Itchaway. I also feel really fortunate to work in a place with so many great people. We all get along really well and there's a lot of passion for ecology. Uh, and, and, and fun times to work hard, but, but still enjoy it. This is the best part of working here by far. I mean, I'm not only the research entomologist, I'm the director of the center, so I stay busy with a lot of things. And having competent, wonderful, awesome, funny people to run my lab for me is, is the best part of my job. People like my research associate Tom and my technicians like Jasmine and Gabriel, graduate students that I've got here working from various institutions, they're the ones that really do the work and that really give me the creative energy to think up big ideas and, and work on the next project. And this is a great place to, to work. It's a great place to be a part of a team because we, we don't have a huge scientific faculty here and so we collaborate a lot. People tend to work together a lot. It's an amazing, incredible ecosystem to work in and there are just so many research questions out there to be answered. We're a small enough place that everyone gets to work together, everyone has to work together we get along well, we have a great time, but we're a big enough place that we can really make a difference.